Hey besties, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you are new to this channel, welcome. I'm Lindo and yeah, you're most welcome to my kitchen. So in today's video guys, as you have seen with the title, I'll be making peppermint crisp tart, but I'll be making it in glasses instead of like a tart tray or a tart pan. So I'm gonna be taking you guys along and showing you how I actually do that so yeah stay tuned and let me show you the ingredients all right so firstly we've got caramel treats so we're only gonna use half of this um, tin because I'm just making like two glasses and then we've got um, fresh cream this is 250 milliliters of fresh cream basically one cup and then we've got tennis biscuits we're gonna use about three quarters of this and then we've got the peppermint crisp tart chocolate no no, no. peppermint yeah peppermint crisp chocolate not tart <laughs> and then i've also got a kit kat uh kit kat gold it's a caramelized type of kit kat and then i've also got mint some fresh mint leaves and then here i've got melted butter it's two tablespoons of melted butter and then I've got this jar over here, which I'm going to be crushing my biscuits in. And then I also have this uh, bowl over here. I'll just be whipping all that I need to whip in here. And then I've got a hand, electric hand mixer. If you don't have this mixer, you can also just use a whisk to whisk, whisk, whisk up until it becomes the consistency that I'm going to show you guys. And then lastly, I've got um, this, <laughs> I've got these two, which I'm going to be using to crush my biscuits. So yeah, stay tuned and I hope you're going to enjoy this video. Yes. Okay, basically, so we're going to start by crushing these uh, tennis biscuits. Like I said, we'll be using like a quarter, I mean three quarters of this. If you don't find uh, tennis biscuits, just get any coconut biscuits. That should work because you know tennis biscuits, it's like coconut biscuits. So yeah. All right, now the real work uh, begins. Biscuits. Now I'm going to go in with my two tablespoons of butter. So I'm just going to add it in there. This is a very quick uh, dessert to make by the way. Okay, so we have mixed our butter and with our margarine right so now I'm just gonna put I'm already gonna put it as the base of the of these glasses so we're just gonna make it the first layer So we are just gonna set these two aside now we need to go in and prepare our cream and our caramel so yeah let's do that okay guys so I'm just gonna add this fresh cream it's about a cup of fresh cream and I'm going to be whipping all of it. Okay, so we are going in and whipping the cream.
this is basically how we want our cream to be you whip it you whip it <laughs> up until like there's like stiff peaks like this and yeah so basically when it's like this it's ready so i'm gonna go in and add half of this caramel treat so this is how it looks like so i'm just gonna add like half half of it inside here and then we're gonna whoop some more Okay, so I'm going in and I'm whipping again. can mixer then you need to whip um, the cream on its own and also whip the caramel on its own and then mix it together once they are both nice and smooth because it'll be difficult if you're gonna add the caramel onto the whipped cream if you are using a whisk so whisk them separately and then bring them all together so now we need to add crushed chocolates in here um, yeah, so I'm going to show you that now. Okay, so we are done with our chocolates and just going to add it in our cream and caramel mixture. Alrighty. Okay, so we're just gonna mix this. Just mix, like, fold it in a folding manner. Yeah. Okay, so this is fine. Done mixing everything. gonna go and assemble everything together but we're pretty much done with everything so we're gonna add these and layer our glasses properly okay besties so we're gonna add our peppermint our cream caramel and peppermint chocolate layer into our glass So now we're gonna go in with the tennis biscuits again, another layer. So we're just gonna layer it properly around. Yes. Yes, 
honey. Okay, besties, so here I've got my mint leaves. Make sure that you rinse them. And then I've also got some chocolate, which I'm gonna sprinkle just like this. Okay, besties, so I'm done sprinkling the chocolate on, on top. Now you can go in and add your mint leaves so that it looks very nice and presentable. So just put it in the center like that. See how cute it looks. And also over here like this. Yep. And you are basically done. But now you're going to put it in the fridge for about four to five hours before you actually um, serve it to, to your family, your friends or whatever. So you first need to put it in the fridge so that it sets. Or you can even put this mint, these mint leaves like afterwards, after it has been in the refrigerator. And then with this Kit Kat, if you want, you can, after the four, four to five hours, then you can add some Kit Kat sticks in here just so that it looks really nice. And it has that chocolatey, you know, kind of feel going on. So you can either use car use this caramel Kit Kat or you can use the normal brown chocolate Kit Kat. So yeah, and that is pretty much it. I'm just gonna take these and set them in the fridge and after four hours, they'll be ready. Anyway, I hope you besties are going to enjoy this when you make it for your family. And thank you very much for tuning into this video. Please do subscribe if you haven't subscribed and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye!